$175 million could be headed to Oklahoma schools. A second race to the top grant application now has Governor Henry's signature on it and will be submitted for federal stimulus dollars. 2 News reporter Beth Burnett has the story new on 2 News at 5. President Karen, earlier this year, Oklahoma applied and was not one of the only two states that were awarded. Grant writers say they had more time to put together the application this time around, and Green Country parents hope Oklahoma is a finalist. School may be off for summer, but Oklahoma legislators are studying ways to get students a portion of 3.4 billion federal stimulus dollars. It's no secret that Tulsa Public Schools could use a cut. Yeah, I'm concerned because the bigger the classes, the less, you know, one-on-one -on -one the kids get. Many parents agree their budgets only go so far. You're asking the parents to give more, and they're going to give as much as they can, but there's got to be other, other ways for the schools to be funded. The race to the top funding could help. I'm a big believer in you can't manage what you can't measure. Chief Education Advisor Kathy Taylor says the grant will give teachers better salaries, better training, and more feedback. To coincide, a piece of legislation was passed with an emergency clause that called for the same principles. So people that normally are not on the same sides of education issues all were on the same side of this legislation and the application. And we think that increases our chances because if they're going to invest $175 million, they want to see statewide impact. Impact on current students and the ones just about to enter the school system. With her being very smart, she's got to be, you know, challenged every day at home. You know, I'm going to do the best I can as a parent to help teach. And the finalists will be announced July 26th. Funding awards will go out at the end of August, and school systems will get the money about 90 days after that. Beth Burnett, 2 News, works for you.